go. Hey, what's up, guys? It's this guy here, and today we're going to be continuing our series of Portal Stories Mel. So, let's begin. I will pause while it's loading. Alright, and we're back. So, we left off in the uh, cryopod room thing. Uh, so, there's Cave Johnson. Let's, let's press. Oh. Um, this doesn't seem right. Don't worry about the heights. Had a few of my scientists make what's called long fall boots. Uh, I mean, amateur science innovators, long fall boots. <laughs> that was easier to think of than I thought. Hmm. Ah, turret. The door shut behind Take that me. yellow device up. Don't worry, it's not hazardous. I've had the scientists leave you a new device to help you. Yeah, that's right. A new test. Congratulations! You get to test something else now. Double the experiments for you. Old reliable. The first A HPD to have three healthy surviving users. <laughs> that laser. Oh, cutscene though. Oh, bright. Very bright. Very bright. <laughs> yeah, dust it off. There's also a door nearby. Should take you out of the building. You'll need that new test to move around. Mm -hmm. Don't worry though, we built the building like this. Did you build the uh, shake? Don't worry about that. It's just uh, a new drilling test we're doing down below. Yeah, <laughs> to get the salt mines deeper, to get more testing spheres in. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Just ignore that. All right. Um, spirit of what? Something I can't see what that says. Uh, National Potato Board for the Promotion of Potato Science, 1955. Cave Johnson, shower curtain salesman, 1943. Aperture fixtures. Hmm. All right. Hmm. It's got a paper clip on it. <laughs> is that a... Yeah, it is. Okay. Hello again, Cave. Remember, alert your su supervisor if you see... Uh, okay. <laughs> oh. Okay, uh... That way. Can I get out of here? Yeah. No. Don't mind all this too. We just had uh, earthquakes. Lots of earthquakes. Yeah. Yeah. You get lots of those here in Michigan. Michigan. Ooh. I guess security intelligence investors payback turbo oh okay Earthquakes uh, even shook up time a bit. Some stuff from the future got here. Yep, that's what? how it's here. Uh, don't worry, future? it's still 1952. Adlai Stevenson is still president. What's, what's from the future? Alright, so, the earthquakes. Kinda did some redecorating in here. Destroy the door too. You'll have to find another way out. This door looks fine. <laughs> the toilets are boarded up. I assume I'm gonna need that, can't go through that. Oh, that door. That door is pretty dead. To the left. 
No, key to the left, do not let letter, do not loiter, do not touch glass. Hmm. I can't touch it. Wait. Wait. Touch. But there's gotta be something you can use to launch yourself over the door. There has to be another way out. Do you shoot me? No, you don't shoot me. What about you? You're fine. Stop trying. Oh, you shoot! Ooh. What? <laughs> look at the look at the paper clip. It's going all orange. Pick up. Snap. Do not tip over. Oh well. Ooh. Saving. This is a portal. Let's go up here. So, the science and business is um, initiative of America in proud part. No, I, I don't know. Best science company to aperture science in. In the year of 1947. Isn't that when they were a shower company? What's in here? Oh, you were just there. And there. Why do I need to be over here? What are these? Focus on the science and future imagine. Oh. I want to go in four. Okay. Hmm. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. I could have just. Okay. Is this? I bumped the edge. I know, ah, glass might look different than what you're used to, but uh, while you were spending that little time sleeping, we had some, some uh, aperture science nanomachines come in and build all this up. Yeah, yeah, that's it. They're quick little guys. Faster than any science guy I got. Yeah. What's this way? Pew. Okay. Oh. Okay, that's scary. When we're, we're not going over there. Yeah, bravo. Beyond that door is one of the new testing tracks. What totally, door? completely new. Get through it and head to the first testing sphere. I'll let you know more there. Now, I just want to make sure you know something before you go any further. We have these new inventions called emancipation grids in place to prevent objects from moving around to other tests. Now some guy decided that it would be a good idea to make ones that prevent people from going through and installed one where people needed to go through. So, so this one kills me then. Station 9896C. Um, what does this do? Breaker zero one three five B main power aperture brand D 
team materializes. Bravo, Volta, Tram Station, Bravo, Volta, Security, Volta. If you turn the power off, you can easily turn it back on. That switch isn't like the rest of them. The other is tricked by a circuit breaker that causes an entire... I think these switches were designed... Ah, oh, no, I cut them off. Maybe your uh, new test can help. Remember, you can always turn the power on or off again. Uh-huh. Is there a portable surface in here? Oh, there it is. Wee. Uh, the... Two switches. Eat. Eat. How do I get over there? I want over. I want over there. I want over. I want to go over there. This is pretty lethic. Oh! That's a lot of water. Is it still going up? Okay. I was really just expecting a big, like, I was really just expecting like another door behind it. Those doors don't they? They're like, ha ha ha, now you have to go through another door. Can I not get up there? Hmm. Really? Wait. Oh, yeah, I can. How does this help me? That's how it helps me. Now I walk along the pipe, shoot a portal there, and there, and go. The new testing track is just through here. Okay. Uh, know your antimatter risks. Why did that close? <sighs> Boop. Burp. That's meant to happen. Just to test your uh, reflexes, you know, after your short sleep. That's scary. Why you do this? Where'd the balls go that were there? Am I meant to be on this? Please don't fall. Please don't fall. Don't fall! Ooh. And loading screen. We'll be back after it loads. And we're back. Please don't. Ah! Why you have to blind me like that? Oh, yes. Bravo Volta, the... hold on. Fifth testing track, yes, fifth. You'll need a portal device to get through. Uh, uh, sorry, I, I meant a portable quantum tunneling device. Look, it's in your hands right now. Uh, the scientists did their job. You'll do fine. And how do you see me? No, 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 no. I assume I need to press start button now.
I wonder. Whoop. Whoop. Wee. Oh, okay. Saving. Now everything about this test is lead line, according to my 1950s notes here in my 1950s filing cabinet. Since it's harmful to humans, uh, I mean, not harmful to humans. You'll be okay. Perfectly fine. Nothing to worry about. Oh, and uh, don't worry about the boxes. We got a ton backstocked ready for this kind of thing. Thrown at the wall, destroyed, rinse and repeat. Useless little things. Made them in an hour. Oh, wait, wait, no, this one needs to go on here, and that one needs to go down there. Ash. Yeah! Ah. Oh. Thank you. You're not dead. That means that high toxicity lead didn't get in the air and, uh, I mean, great job, astronaut, Olympian, or war hero. You really are a merit to science. Or something like that. J just remember the Nuremberg Olympics. The what? How is that meant to help? Alright, and we'll be back. And we're back. Hello again. Hmm. Now see, this test uses the new Aperture Science Innovators Propulsion Gel. It allows you to... No, wait, hold on. This record said they didn't make that in the 70s. Never you mind that. Just, uh, solve science. Uh... Button. How do I do this? No! <laughs> Let's, let's try something.
Oh wow. I didn't even have to do that. Hmm? Propulsion drone. No. That's speed science. Mm. Alright. Oh, hold up a second. Mel, I don't think you're that stupid that you're going to fall for this anymore. I'll be blunt now. I'm not Cave Johnson. Thought so. This isn't the 1950s. Everyone you knew and loved is dead. Oh. And now you're stuck here in after science, done with the trash. Like me. Oh, you're after not trash. Because of that boat. Which I'm sure you already knew, but uh, whatever. 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 However, I can get us out of here. If you're willing to let a voice in the sky who just told you he was lying the entire time he was talking to you control nearly every movement you make. Is that okay? No. I, I, I'll just take your silence as a yes. No! Oh, right. You can't answer me. Uh, uh, just do what I say and you'll be fine. No. Okay? No. That is not okay. Comprende? How is this? How is that? What? Oh, Radiation needs not to be feared, but it must command your respect or your protection. Ooh. Can I just like do I need the box up? And didn't mean to do that. Loading screen. <clears throat> Excuse me. Be sure. There we go. So about before, you can get why I said all that, right? No. I'd rather not have my one chance of escape have a panic attack and die on me after years of being suspended in a faulty relaxation vault. Which could be a real possibility, because as my records show, the old test could cause heart attacks after small exposure to the chemicals. <laughs> and you were full of them. So, 
Let's all just take a breath and start over. My name's Virgil. I'm a core from up in the enrichment center. And before you even think of asking, yes, there is a building above you. And yes, I came from it. I'm not crazy. Don't be too alarmed, though. A lot's changed since you got put on ice. Uh... See that pipe there that the repulsion gel's leaking on? That'll take you to the pumping station. Jump down and walk on it. Oh, and try not to fall off. That goo down there is corrosive, and it doesn't like human skin. Mm-hmm. Well, that's normally what corrosive means. That is burning off human skin. 2046. To my records of this room, there should be a turret shooting range at the far side of the room. If you can get through there, you should be able to get to the fourth testing track. That'll take you up to where I am. I wanna, I wanna quickly uh, test something. Ow! That was instant death. Okay. Oh, good, I tested that. Um, how do I get through this? Great shot to the next testing track. Go to that door down at the very end. You know, the one with the giant wheel on it. Okay. Do it again. It'll open this time, I swear. Just give it some elbow grease. Nah. Oh, come on, you've got this. One more shot. Well, great. You 
you can fling yourself all over the place and get past some old turrets that are firing light rounds, but you can't get a door open? What kind of Olympian are you? Ugh. Alright. Let's see what we can do. There's a longer route through a repulsion gel pumping station. Mm. Guess you're going to have to go that way. Alright, well... Uh, let's see. No horse play. Do not play. Do not let it be continuous yourself. Okay, well, I'm gonna leave this episode here. Calm. Uh, thank you guys for watching. See you in the next episode. Um, I don't know when the next episode will come out. Maybe one week. Depends if I'm busy, basically. But, thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next episode of Portal Stories Mail. Have a good day and goodbye.